So now we have the water with the acid added and it's in and the universal indicator which gives us the red ring. And I'm going to add some base to it or back to it. And it's going to take quite a bit, I suspect. But we're going to try to push it back into the basic region then to get the original green color back and hopefully all the way back into the Oh, it's still mostly yellow. I'm adding the base back to it. And so you can see the color changing in layers here, but as I stir it in, it's equaling out the pH. So right now the top is basic and the bottom is still acidic, but as I keep stirring here, you'll notice it's going back more towards uh, even a little bit on the acid side. It's close to neutral right now. So add some more base. And... Um, actually, that's a different demonstration that we'll do later in the year. Uh, that uses densities, uh, and a lot of times the colors there are artificial. But I'm having trouble getting all the way to the bottom there. But ignoring the little bit on the bottom, we're into the basic range now, and if I add just a little more, we should be able to get it out of that teal color into the purple color. And again, my stir rod's not quite long enough to go all the way to the bottom, so I'm not quite getting the color all the way throughout.